As you all know, we have been doing road trip through Kerala state for two weeks, and here we are reaching towards the end of our trip. A series of unfortunate events happened, so let me brief you a little bit about it before we arrive at Puvarai. Okay, let's start the trip then. Driving through beach stretch before Varkala. Excited for Varkala for beach fun, food, and trippy feel. Beach photography time or not? It was so risky. I actually went down and it was scary. Like the phone, camera, again. Okay, let's fix this. New clothes, check. Food, check. belongings because this is going to be island resort so we won't be able to come to our vehicle to pick up stuff so if I, whatever we miss like charger or you know extension or any any camera or gadgets take so everything you can boat is waiting for us so the vehicle is parked here and that side boat is waiting feeling the excitement Another level excitement. We just reached Poover Island Resort. So this is in a place called Poover in Kerala, very close to Kovalam or Thiruvananthapuram. If you know these places. Found what we're looking for in life. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. Let me show you. This is really, really spacious. 
So I'm sure that I'm going to have a really nice stay here in Maharaja Suite in Poover Island Resort. What do you guys think? Doesn't it look like Mexican sky and the clear blue water? This is really amazing. We just walked all around the resort enjoying the sea, the estuary, lagoon, backwater. I don't know the correct terminology is always but however, we just walked and walked along the water here. The sun, fresh air, the views, it's amazing, amazing. You can just totally relax and enjoy in this vacation. Here is a different boat. We are going for the backwater cruise. Look! Actually, today is very relaxing weather. As you can see, it's cloudy. It's not sunny. We are just going in the afternoon time. But otherwise, if it's really sunny, you can choose to go in the morning. And I'm excited! coconut trees in my front and uh, some other boats it's really serene it's peaceful and we are not hurrying we told them that okay we are here till the lunch time so yeah let's just go around let me show you the view that I have right now Thanks. this and which you should definitely do you can contact the reception here and they will arrange the tour for you and it's uh, really nice we love to see the forest areas all around the palm trees and the narrow canyons of water we will see many types of birds all around let me show you what Anki is doing <laughs> so just one by one he has damaged now the GoPro <laughs> let me show you what he is doing with the GoPro Man, no, no, please save the GoPro at least. So this North Indian guy, he seems to really enjoy southern part of India. That I'm, I'm always taking him to eastern side of India so that he sees all these greenlands and uh, you know this uh, river canals, lakes, etc. And now as we are in Kerala, he is just enjoying all the food, the scenery, everything, See, I'm really the enjoying. birds, the birds. Just check this out. Resort is one of our favorite beach resort in South Kerala. Various categories of rooms available here to suit your budget, some with jacuzzi inside bathroom, plenty of resort space to roam around, very well maintained lawns and garden areas by the sea, common swimming pool area surrounded by trees and very tasty food served at in-house restaurant. There is a separate Ayurveda village inside the resort which also has very nice and peaceful accommodation facilities inside, special restaurant serving Ayurveda cuisines, common pool for that particular area and full-time doctors. We met the doctor there who gave us a lot of information about the packages and showed us around. Stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away. Show us where we had a very good evening, uh, so the weather was good. Uh, we went for the backwater cruise, and after that, we did not do much, so we just relaxed, watched all around, and you know, just enjoyed being in the nature. 
and this evening we are going to relax in our room and look there the sunset just happened we have the post golden hour light right now how come the stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are what makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of i wonder sky sometimes hides behind the clouds maybe it's just like me a little bit scared of heights why does the rain always keep on pouring down when it's gray outside it really makes me wonder It's just the evening time where we are just sitting outside our room and we are going to enjoy some drinks and snacks as we sit by the sea. This is so relaxing. Yeah, it makes me wonder. It really makes me wonder. So tonight we have ordered the food in our room. This is really tasty soup. I already finished. I was really hungry. This is chili fish. Rice, fried rice, calamari, some salad, and something in sweet dish. Mm. And this all tastes so so good, so good. morning guys i slept so well and waking up to the sea view is such a bliss and guess what we are going to the beach in the reception area they always do the arrangements to take you from this island resort to the beach it's a very small distance i can see it right there and i'm excited to go there we are uh, walking just inside the resort and it's actually a very nice area it's a huge space just by the beach we are here look at this boat we are going to reach the beach there Life jacket is mandatory for your safety that's what we are doing right now and look there there is the beach and we are going to reach in just few minutes we expected today to be sunny but it's uh, actually cloudy so let's see how we get the weather there okay so we have reached the beach oh, <laughs> look here it is isn't this awesome
exhausted. We, we really had a good time in the beach. And look, there, there An Anki is packing his gadgets. Hey, it's time to go back. I wish I could stay somewhere like this always in my life. This is so good. As expected, Hoover Island never disappoints me. Combination of beautiful landscapes, ocean, backwaters full of life and activities all around. I did not expect after having so much challenges during the trip like heavy rains, landslides and broken cameras, I would still be calmly looking at the ocean and enjoying my last day. Kerala has taught me a lot about life itself and made myself more clear about my journey ahead. Over these 14 days, I have witnessed almost everything one can see during their trip to Kerala, ranging from extreme adventure to luxurious dream stays. Every next destination was different and stunning. I would still say these 14 days are not enough for me to explore entire Kerala state and sure, I would be coming back here again and again.